Right. So, Fairlane has added two levels to the map, the default map, the template map. So, I'm going to show you. He needs a crash helmet. Yeah, he does need a crash helmet. <laughs> he does. He does need a crash helmet. But he's fine. I've checked his back legs. Nothing's broken. His, back, his spine seems to be fine. He's fine. The fact he's gone back downstairs seems to, it gives the impression that he's okay. Anyway. Right. So, Phil... <laughs> get, get, get him as soon as send him down on a cable. <laughs> crash helmet. Oh, crash helmet is coming in Nico 1 2. Yeah, I suppose. I suppose. <laughs> <coughs> right. So, these are the five levels. Uh, parachute. Yeah, probably better with the parachute. These are the five levels. That came with the template, yeah? The template that I gave you. Now, Fairlane has added two more. These two fellas here, these two. Let's see if I can make it a little bit bigger. So, so we've now got two more levels. And so these are Fairlane's levels. So No, he didn't. No, he didn't. Um, where's the character set? Oh, that's character editor. Where's the character set? Uh, blah, 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 character set. Yeah, the first fifteen, the first sixteen characters are intact. The first fifteen, sixteen characters. Yeah, it's sixteen characters. The top row need to be left, left, left alone. Not the fifteen. Yeah, which is that one there. Fifteen is that one. Not that one. So the top row needs to be left, yeah? I have a task. Yes, I am I'm sorting that out, mate. Um there's a few there's a few things going on. Uh, I'll get to it, all right? Yes. I, I gathered that you'd only add it because this H turned up. This H turned up. Uh, where's the tile editor? Uh, no, 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 no. View tile set. Yeah, the H turned up. That's the difference that I noticed. So, so I am wondering is you start there, finish there, yeah? Start there, finish there. So I think. I, I I like it. I like it. When I saw it, I thought, "Ho oh, oh, ho, oh, that's nice." So now, Stacy, Stacy, you're on. Right, here's yours. Right. So this is st stack bats, Stacy's, and it's great. But the first fifteen cat, the first fifteen characters got destroyed. Um. So I can't. I can't import it. So I don't know what happened. Don't know. Don't know what happened. Um, because the these these have come down here. So yeah, these first fifteen char characters got got um, scrambled. I can. I, I, that's the only thing I can call it scrambled. So I don't know. All right. So I like this idea. I like this idea. Um, but what we need to what what I thought what I yeah what I was thinking was we need to start an endpoint as well like uh, Fairlane, Fairlane's done in his identify it looks like he's identified the start and end points yeah so for the bottom two <laughs> what what's the exclamation mark here <laughs> right. So we have got um, a map to play with, yeah? So we got seven levels here. 
Hey Proton. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why it's screwed up. Oh, stack. Hang on, mate. I see that you've you've give me another one. Hang on. Let's put that in there. See what this one looks like. My head is not in the right place at the moment. Right, let's load it up. Ah, there we go. There we go. 15 characters are in the right spot. There we go. Right, so we've got another 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 level. So what we'll go if you you guys carry on making the levels we'll can we can add them now stackbacks is stackbacks has got a different character set so what we've got it there's a, there's a thing that we're gonna have to do so we're gonna have to load in the character set the character attributes and the tiles yeah for each um, map so when we render it on the screen, we'll have all the information because I think the tile sets will be different for different uh, uh, people's maps. And so we need to make sure, we need to make sure that we've got the right, the right tile set, the right um, maps and stuff like that. I'm just wondering, because of the added characters at the end, that's what screwed it up. Have a look. Let's see if we if we do this and then save. Does it screw it up? No, it didn't. Okay. So that's what we're going to have to try and do. So I have been cheating a little bit, and I have brought in the map the map functions. from um, Hunchback because they are optimized to within an inch of the lives because we did we spent an awful long time on this lot so I brought them through so as you can see there's some errors because we haven't got the, the map tiles in we haven't got the characters in um, but this should this should work once we um, add that extra functionality because what we're going to be doing is we're going to be copy if there's a different character set we're going to be copying the character set into the the, the character uh, place that we're going to be dealing with we'll copy the tile set and we're going to copy the map into us and uh, I've called it a staging area where is it where's the thing here so I've 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 created I've copied it now into ladies and gentlemen 6502 kebab has entered the chat <laughs> No, he hasn't. <laughs> no, he hasn't. Oh, oh, it's came. Bottle, if you want one, go grab one. Right. So we've got staging. I've got a staging for the uh, level and a staging for the colour. But what I, what I haven't done is done the staging for the tile, the tile set. <laughs> No, mate, no. I was just saying. <laughs> oh my god, more bits? Thank what? you very much. Oh, you Doxter. guys really spoil me. Doxter, thank you for the bits. Thank you. So, so this, um, this here, initialize map variables, right? This is where we are going to, um, because I've we've got a macro that sets up the map. 
Where is it? Where is it? Uh, draw. That's draw tile. Oh, where's the map function? I was. Was I messing around with it? No, I wasn't. This is just doing the governing, isn't it? Oh yeah, I've got them in there. So, with there's a the, there's a, f a map function somewhere. It's got to be a map. It's got to be a map. Aha! There it is. Here. So we've got a macro that sets up the um, the the map. Yeah. So we're we're telling it which map number, and we're assigning some self-modifying code of where the map lo where the map array is. So we're going to have to do the same thing for the tile set, the uh, character set, um, the attributes for the ca characters, because they may not be the same when all things are even and equal. I don't think we need to worry about the tile set. Uh, sorry, yeah, we need to worry about the tile set, but not the tile attribute. So we don't need to worry about the tile attributes. So what we need to do is every time we, every time we um, initialize for a new map, we're going to have to copy the character set across the tile set, the character attributes, and the map into the staging area. Yeah, and then we use the staging area as the the map. Yeah, so instead of as before, Hunchback, we was looking at the map directly. Sounds like a lot of hard work. Well, you know, it, we're, if we're gonna make, if we're gonna allow people to create their own levels um, with custom character sets, we can't guarantee that the character sets will be the same. As Fairlane's shown, he added another tile, so we need to make sure that we cater for that fact. That if somebody comes back with a space themed um, level, that we implement the character set so it's just a case of um, you know just getting it all sorted out now all this should work all this should work it's just that these things here and zero G <laughs> yeah I suppose um, and this and where's the other one I think there was a tile set wasn't it that's the hood map. That's not. That's the hood map. That's going to be a different animal altogether. That is. But yeah, we can still work that one out. Uh, hood character attributes. So this is what I've copied out of Quasi. So because I thought. We can use quite a lot of it. Draw screen. That's the other one. Yeah, because I've changed it to, to grab from the stage, put it on the screen. Grab from the colour stage, put it on the screen. So we just need to set up. We just need to set up um, the character set. And right, let's let's... Let's start thinking about that. Right, storage. Because I think I've got the... Right, I've got the map array there. Um, I can't remember if I set up the staging area, which I don't think I have. Right, so... Um, ooh, that's a constant, isn't it? Staging. Constant, constant. Where's constants? Game constants. Where are you? Where are you? Okay. There. That's where it is. Right. So we're going to put the... Right. So the staging RAM is going to be in B1000. Right. So that, so it's well out of the way. So we can't... It can't get destroyed in any way, shape or form. So, um, character set, character set. So if we say that we're allowing 255 characters, um, what does that mean then? Right. Now the staging RAM, 
is 600. Hello, John here. Thank you for following. Hope you enjoy the stream. Say hello. Who's just followed? Say hello. We won't buy. Honest. Say hello. I can't see the screen, so I don't know who's followed. Thank you, Stuart. Say hello. Right. So, we need to figure this out. Right, how much have I given for um, the maps? Each map is... Six hundred, isn't it? Oh, storage. Here we go. Ah, yeah, six hundred bytes. Each map is going to be six hundred bytes. Right. Let's go back to constants. Right. So six hundred bytes. So that's going to be um, calculator. Can't be bothered to work it out in my head. Seems my template isn't working. What what template? Two five eight. Yeah, I, I still I've st still got to work that out. Um, I've, I'm I'm redeveloping the monitor because I need to create a Twitch. I need to create a Twitch application so I can um, read the follows. You can't read the follows um, without using the Twitch API. But to make the Twitch to access the Twitch API, you need to create yourself a Twitch application. And that's and I'm working on that. It's that's going to be my monitor, uh, which is running at the moment because it does the subscriptions, it does the bits. Because if you notice, the the monitor sends the bot the commands that say I've had a subscription and I've had a had bits, but the follow can't be done by how we've done our bot. We have to create a Twitch a uh, Twitch application. So I've created a, a new app called the uh, Twitch Monitor, and I'm writing that to monitor the, my Twitch channel as an application, and then send the commands to the bot, which then then the bot reacts. It's all good fun. It's all good fun. Right. So we need a stage. We've got the staging RAM, but that's way too much. That is way too much. We don't need all that. Now, the maps are 600 characters, so I can say that. All right, and the color RAM, the color, color is gonna be 600, isn't it? Or is it? Why did I do that like that? Why did I make it? No, that's B naught naught. This is going to be 300. We'll do four to be on the safe side. I'm not sure. Oh, need to look. Staging RAM. Oh, okay. Okay. Now I understand. Now I understand. Yeah, I understand now. We're taking the 600 tiles and then rep replicating them in here. So 
basically that's six, 600 times by four. Let's just check that times four. Yeah, that's why that's at 8,000. That's why that's at 8,000. So okay, so the stage, uh, the staging ram is actually the color, is actually the screen, the the map decompressed. So I need a, st I need a stage, I need staging maps, don't I? Right. Right. So where should we put them? Um, I think we're turning everything off, aren't we? I think, are we turning everything off? Well, I haven't turned everything off here. But I think we'll be turning everything off. So we will stick them in. Um, yeah, we'll stick them. I don't think I'm using C1000. No, right. Uh, stage um, tile set. So, hi, John here. Another subscriber. Stay on. Gary. Stay forever. Oh, thank you, mate. Gary. Nine months. Wow. Wow. Uh, dot label. Uh, Character attributes. Character. We'll do it. We'll do it small. Attributes. So if the tile set, let's say, how many we're saying there's in a tile? How many? How many tiles were in that one? Bless you. And again. And how many tiles were in this one? 55. So if we say 128 tiles, that you've got guys have got 128 tiles. So that's going to be C3 80. <laughs> Did you hear that as well? <laughs> C3PO. Um, I might, I might just do that. So 256, and the character attributes. So we'll say, we'll say that's going to be. Um, we'll say we're going to have 255, 256 characters in a tile set, in a character set. So that'll be there. Now, the um, character set I think I've got that defined somewhere haven't I here we go character set so that's where the character that's where the character sets gonna go and that's the second lot so the 128 so that's where we're going to put the character set. So when we load the map, that's where we're going to put it. But we're going to load the map up into the C1000 mark. Yeah. Right. So that means that here, when we decode, when we decode the map, which is up here somewhere, draw hood, no. Uh, evaluate left column. Here we go, export screen. Here. This should be pointing to our, um, that should be pointing to the staging area. So that can be still this here, but it'll be fixed. But this needs to be changed to copy to the staging area. Right. Uh, 
How am I going to do that? So if we initialize the map. And then do an export. Now the export needs to export from the screen to the screen area. That that could be okay. That could be okay. Oh, that could be okay. Um, we don't need that. We don't need these. We don't need these. We'll just that initialize map. We'll put, we'll, we'll, right, okay. We don't need these. We don't need these. Right, let's go back here. So, uh, no, here. So we're going to send in the map. Now we've got an array. Yeah, we've got an array here. Of where the maps are going to go. So, um, so we need to map array. We need to put in um, where character set. So where the character set is going to be mapped to. Uh, might do that as a word. Might do that as a word. We'll think about that. Character attributes. And they're going to be bytes. Um, so character set, character attributes. Oh, tile set. Uh, word. Oh, that's not a byte. It's a word, isn't it? It's a reference. These are references. Right. Um, so... Let's put this into reality. So let's put this into reality. So I need, um, who's have we got? Right, so this is uh, fair lanes, isn't it? So this is the template plus fair lanes. So um, we'll do this, we'll export this. Export the lot, not in Nico's run. Up there. And then we will do the same for Stacy's map. So we can test our theories. Export everything. Right, so we should have some new files. There we go. There we go. Right. Um, where am I going to put this lot? Uh, um, 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 I put them in the root, I think. Right. So there's the map. That's the uh, that's the single one, isn't it? Yeah, that's the single one. That's the three set. So. If that is at the end, yeah, we'll put them there, right. Okay, so we are changing that for, see if this will pick it up, hunch, fair lane. Oh, come on, give me the highlighter. Can I do that? Oh, even better. There we go.
<laughs> yes, Doxter is a distinguished. I, I'm a, I, I, that was a thing. Chat highlighting. Hang on. Here we go. Here we go. Um, let's do that. I don't. Do I need to save? Say hello, Doxter. Say hello. Go on, test it out. Say hello. There we go. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Nailed it. Um. Oh, we have subscribers as well. Let's do the subscriber one. There we go. Right, anybody who's a subscriber, it will highlight your message. So, Gary, do you want to give it a try? Seeing as you was the last one to subscribe. There we go. It's a new thing that Twitch have just bought out. I forgot to do it. No, no, it's for you as well. It's a new feature in the chat box. Oh, so it's only for me. Oh, this is what happens. This is what happens. All right, so it's only for me. Okay. So this is the highlighting. So it's oh so it highlights for me. Okay. I thought it highlighted for everybody. Ah oh, right, okay. Yeah, it's a new feature. So it allows you to target your VIPs and subscribers. There's also um you know it, it does suspicious users first time chatters i'm not going to do mention because the bot does that i won't do the mods because they know how to get hold of me yeah all right okay so it's just for me oh even better even better sorry guys i thought it was for everybody I thought it was for everybody. But it's it's in the chat window. It's a setting in the chat window. Cause I saw it when I was on phase when I was on phaser stream. Oh, hang on, what's that saying? Um Highlight visible to streamers. Highlight available to moderators. Ooh, hang on. We're all basking in Doxter's shiny light. Yes, we are. We are, we are. Right, so, maps. So we've got seven maps, so we need to change that array. To have seven because we've only got uh, one, two, three, four, five. Six. Oh my god, more bits? Thank you very much. <laughs> you guys really spoil me. Oh, thanks, Doctor. Hey, it's come up on there now. I can see it. <laughs> nice. Right, so uh, that's going to be 3,000 and that's going to be 3,6. So we'll do it here as well. So three thousand three six. So that's done that. Now the character set. Character set. We need to bring in the character set. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, this is gonna be the troublesome bit because we're importing directly into the character set and we're not going to do that anymore. So um we will create 
another one called char sets and we will put all the character sets in there so we'll call this um, that's it there <laughs> Why is Andy in the trusted <laughs> trusted members list? <laughs> I think he's trusted because he's a mod, I think. He's trusted because he's a mod. So, uh, character sets. Um, oh, no. Let's change that. So, we'll, we'll call this Hunchback punch back to CS because we're gonna have to do this for where is he uh, stack bats CS oh uh, map isn't it map one there now um, 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 uh, um. how are we going to derive how many characters it is <laughs> you've had in <laughs> had enough bashing right so now we got a problem that we could have two we could have character sets of different lengths so for example that's 119 and oh i didn't realize that was a skyline oh it's a skyline is that a skyline is that the city is that a cityscape in the background i didn't realize that And how many's in this one? Right, that one has got 157. Right, so we're going to have to do a bit of working out here. Um, so, uh, uh, um, how are we going to do this? This should do it. That should do it. That'll give us a number of characters. So, um, and we'll do that from here. John, pay attention to chat. How can people make their own maps if you import the maps at compile time? They're, they're making the maps in the character, in um, the char pad, right? And then I import them in, yeah? I haven't... I haven't got to the point where... I haven't... I was thinking about when if we had a, a disc that we could put the maps on a disc and then load them off the disc. But at the moment, I'm just putting them in memory at the moment. Yeah. If we get loads and loads of maps that's bigger than the memory, then we'll we'll build in a we'll build in the mechanics to be able to uh, load them off the disc. Yeah, a D a D64, which we haven't actually t we haven't actually gone into some serious detail about how you would load um, files into memory using the standard file uh, load system which will be interesting I suppose so we could do that in the long term 
yeah where we where we decide to allow allow people to put their own maps on and just storm onto the d you know the d64 right so that is going to be that so that gives us our count and that will give our count as well right so we need to do the same with the um, tile set and the um, character attributes but the character attributes will be the same as the character set But the character attributes will actually be the number of characters. Hmm. I'm just wondering now if I need those. I need these. Right, let's do the tile set. So, hunch. Hunch back. Tile set. Right, so bring the tile sets in. Tiles, that's that one there. Now, how am I how going to work out how many tiles we've got? Um, it's divided by four, isn't it? Divide by four, isn't it? Four characters per tile. So that would give us the tile set count. It's better to do them in cold blocks. And do this. <laughs> it came about whales. <laughs> Hopefully, that will make sense. Now we've done them in cold blocks. Hopefully, that will make sense now. So, 
So maps. Uh, oh, we need to do um, need to do Stacy's map, don't we? Right, so let's get rid of that for the moment and we'll split and we will go to the storage system on that one. There we go. Right, so maps. So let's do this properly. Maps dot that. Because there's seven maps in here. Let's do that and then that. Right, that's probably not liking it because I don't think I'm importing it now. Right, but now we can put in, say, now stacks, stack maps. map in which is maps dot that and then the character sets right so we can uh, let's see we'll make the maps relational make the maps relational so um, hunchback to hunchback to so that's gonna be one two three four five six seven maps and then we'll do one for stack maps Uh, character we haven't done the character attributes but we'll do the the TS the tile sets so one two three four five six seven and then stasis so we're still we're still in line so one to seven and then stasis eight um, character attributes we haven't put them in yet but we also need um, for the character sets we need the character count so we know exactly how many characters we've got in the character set so, uh, ooh, that's going to be CS that. So, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then that. And the only reason we've got the character count in there is when we're doing the copy across, yeah? Into the staging place. And same with here as well. So, TS count. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I have made a muck up of this, and I yeah, I've done that one right, and then I did that one wrong. Right, so um, I don't know why the maps is not showing. Maps is there. 
We'll put another one of these in. Tire sets. Uh, I need to put the attributes, character attributes in, don't I? Let's do that here. Right, uh, let's do CA. Oh, that's in map array. Okay, that's that's okay. Now I don't think we need character count. I don't think, but we'll leave it in there just in case. Right, um, so this is the character attributes. It's that one. That one. And then we'll do the same here. So, uh, CA dot punch back to two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right, that's working this out, working this out. Right, so that's the array. Right, next thing, let's get rid of that. Maps, so we need to initialize now. So we send in the map number and we are storing the map in the array. So, um, export screen, that's where we want to go. Map tile. Okay. Here, right. There are the tiles. Right, let's do that. So now we are looking at tile set. And in it, tile low. Right. 
So that would set the tile set here. This is the this is the character attribute. So Well, that's not going to work, is it? Because I've done it as a word. Done it as a word. Right, so let's do a bit of jiggery pokery. So transfer y into a uh, times by 2 and then transfer a into x. So that's the character attribute. Character attribute, screen. Tile location offset. Tile location offset, where's that? Hmm. Do we store that somewhere? Can't do. Where? Okay. Tell me what that number is going to be. Where's that number? Let's go find it. Hmm. Hmm. 
Hmm, I don't know where that number's coming from. Let me load up the old one. Aha, uh -huh, there it is. All oh, right, so it's in game map. Oh, there it is. Didn't see that. Right, okay. So that, when we initialize, when we initialize, that should um, set up the exporter. But it won't, it won't do, the copy across, the character set copy across. So, um, I don't want to do it in there. Okay, so um, So initialize there. Um, no, no, Gary. See you later, mate. Okay, right, so this is where we're going to start. So we initialize the where we're going to save it to. Right, so let's put the looper in here. Right, so load map character. So that's where we're going to load it from, and then we're going to store it to um, there. So that's De that defaults where we're going to store it. That's going to be done from up there. Right, so we're going to do the same thing as we've done down here. 16-bit add. Whoops. So we're going to do a 16-bit add. Oh, add, yeah. So we're going to add one to that. and add one to that. Mm. 
Now, how are we going to... Um... How are we going to make sure we're not going to copy over something? Um... Think, John, think. Okay, so I and Y. Right, that should do it. Right, that should do it. Right, so let's split it. So here, we need to populate that Store it in export level character set dot map character set. So that initializes it. Why are you not liking that? Oh, missed, missed that. So that initialize that, and then we need to initialize that. So, um, uh, character set count and then store it into uh, number, there we go, right that should, that should, um, sort that out okay um let's see if this will work right before we do the raster let's do the init map one And then JSR map dot X is it map? Yeah, map that. So that does this character set and JSR uh, map I 
All right, mate, no problem. I'll uh, talk to you later, yeah? Export screen. And I think the other one is draw screen. There you go, draw screen. Right. Oh dear. Um, right. So, I wonder if this all assemble. No. Now, why is that's in macros? That's in macros. A draw tile. Am I using draw tile? No. Okay. Oh, that's the hood, isn't it? And we ain't put the hood in yet. Hang on. Let's put a placeholder for hood. Where is it? Map hood. Let's put a placeholder for mat. We're not going to use it, but we'll stick one in. Um... Hopefully that'll sort that out. <laughs> Character attributes. Uh, we'll do the same for that as well. Any more? Quasi lives. Where's that? Oh, maps. Really? What's that on? Oh, draw hood. Uh, okay. Um, oops. Let's just run that out temporarily. Oh, you're joking me. Lip sprites? Where the hell's lib sprites? Oh, unknown sim symbol lib sprites. Oh, okay. Display project. Well, we're not doing that. We're not doing anything on the hood yet. Right. Ugh. Hang on. I will divide by two. Display timer. Let's do that because there's an error in there as well. They need to be rewritten anyway. Because they've got bugs in them. Right. Verbal is not present it's in character set. Okay. Character set. TS. Character set. Hunchback. Hunchback 2.
But it is. That is spelt the same, isn't it? Uh, where are we? Line 82. Game storage. Oh, we're not in game storage, are we? Game storage. Why don't you like that? annoying where's game storage game constants game attributes oh where's game storage yeah well, that was my next thing but I'm not importing game storage and I'm just wondering if that's the issue. I'm not importing game storage. Now, I think that may m m that might be the issue, mate. To be honest, or oh, I can't do it there. Um, we'll do it here. Let's try that. Nope. Okay. No, it's only in game storage. Okay. Let's do this then. Let's put it before we reference it. So let's put it there. Eighty-two game storage. It just does not like it, does it? Even though it's there. Oh, that is strange. Oh, ah, aha. That might be the problem oh no it's not no it's not because it's not in it's not in no it's not in any namespace oh really Now it'll complain. I'm wondering if it's related, it's referring to this. Right, need to change. So it's now moaning now, all of them. So we need to change up here. Right, so array tile set.
Right. That was it. Boom. Right, let's put a breakpoint in here. Where all the good stuff happens, just there. Right, so our character set is at 4-8, I think. 4-8. Four, eight. I think that's what we've set it to, isn't it? Oh, that's Hunchback. Go away. Uh, where's the carriage set? Okay. Ah, there. Four, eight. Okay. Ugh. So, so that's setting everything up. Right, so the first thing we're doing is exporting the character set. Right, so that's defaulting our storing, and this is where our character set, 1E70, let's have a look. 1E70, is that where our character set is? Yes it is, that is definitely where our character set is. Right, so, um, where's our compare? Compare with 9E, so, okay. So we'll put a breakpoint there and we'll tell it to do it. Right, it's done it. Oh, no, it hasn't. Let's do that. F11. There we go. Oh, it popped a fuse. So that's where it popped a fuse. Oh, look at the stupid mistake, John. Oh, stupid mistake. Right, so that's where the character set's going to go. Uh, so we'll follow this down. So that's setting everything up. Oops. There we go. So we want it to stop there. No, not there. There. Go. Aha. Right, okay. Then it goes to there. Now it's going to set up the characters. Right, does it change this value here? Come on. Come on. Nice. There we go. Right. F11. Ooh. Right, we know the export's working now. Put a break point before it does the draw. So it says it's exported to the screen. And the screen is B thousand. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Oh, 
we need to um, turn off the ROMs, don't we? Oh, game logic. Uh... Hang on, that's not right. Initialize game flow. Initialize game flow. That's there. Initialize game. Ah, here we go. Turn basic off. Right. Let's see. Right, let's see if it draws them draws it on the screen. All we need to do is see it draw on the screen. Load store. Okay. Well that's come out, so Oh the draw's not working. Draw's not working. Okay. So the draw of the screen should be just taking what's in the state in staging area, which should now have our mapping. Let's have a look. Let's see if it looks anything similar. Here we go. Okay, well, that's definitely something. Right. Let's go in. Right, load BA store four thousand. Okay, let's put a breakpoint there. See if it fails there. No, it's gone through. Right, four thousand. We should some have something at four thousand. Yes, we do. Hi, John here. Another subscriber. Stay a while. Stay forever. SP. Thank you for subscribing, mate. 15 months. Wow. <laughs> 15 months. Uh, right. Let's... Where's that magic screen? Ah, is this it? Is this the magic screen? Four thousand, what we're looking at, four thousand. So that goes up to two thousand. Right, there. That's our screen. But it doesn't look Hmm. 
screens at 4000 characters at 38 so why can't we see anything what am I missing John What am I missing? Oh, the character set's at 4.8. I've put it at 5,000, haven't I? Oh! Hang on. Yeah. Oh, colour, that's at BA. We'll have to have a look at the colour as well. Um, but I think I've put the, I think I've copied the character set into the wrong place. Um, oh, character char set animation. Well, no wonder it's not showing. It's that. That's what I want. All right, let's try that again. Right, I'm going to put a breakpoint there and let it go in. Okay. Well, it's done something. in um, this one map one that's what should be on the screen it's not quite right is it I must be missing something Right, I've got the other hunchback open. Let's do that one. Oh, see you later. Hey Steve, 8-bit, welcome. Welcome, welcome. We are trying to redo our game that we got so far and then we abandoned it because it was getting silly right that's that's it right so if I F8 and we go to 4000 because uh, that's where the screen is and we'll do a quick map so that's 4000 that's what the screen should look like Hello, John here. Thank you for following. Hope you enjoy the stream. Hey, Steve. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you for following. Uh, everybody loves to code. Everybody loves to code. It's, we try. We make it look easy, but it's a lot difficult than you think. Right. I want to grab that. 
that'll give me an idea of what's going on. Let's see if the numbers look the same because they don't. No, they don't. <laughs> yeah. I wish I was I wish it was as easy as you think that doing it now. Um zero eighteen zero eighteen, that's not right. That's not right. That's not how it should be coming out. We should be getting 0 f 0 f 0 f 0 f 21 22. Hmm. So we need to look at the exporter and see what it's see how it's working. Right, exporters it be. There. Where's the color? Colors okay. Three two three two. Oh, hang on. Three two three two. It should be all black. And then we've got sevens. That's them there. Oh, this. Right, this. That looks like. That looks like that. I wonder if that is this. So we get we're getting close. We're getting close. It's just not just not close enough. The colours are right. Because this is the bell and the and the rope. Okay. Um, hey, Nicomo. I wonder what's causing that. So we're getting this bit here and we're getting that. And we're actually getting the flames as well there. So it looks like the col well the colour's not quite right, I suppose. I wonder if our um tile Extract is not working very well. Um, how am I going to do this? So it's in the export screen where we're having issues this bit. Uh, da, da, da. So we're setting where the tile map is here. Which sets that. This is the... Hang on a sec. Uh, 
map tiles. Uh, bet that's in here. There. Hang on, that's loading the va that's loading the absolute low value, isn't it? Right, okay, that could be the issue because I'm. Oh, I am. Okay, gonna have to walk through it, I think. Gonna have to walk through it. Gonna be boring and walk through it. Right, so let's walk through it. Let's see what's happening. Sets it up. Zero. We're oh, loading twenty six twice. Twenty six, twenty six. Is that right? Is that where it stored it? No, that can't be right. That's there. Where's the map data? Character set. Maps. Right, so the top first, the tile set. Character set. 27.26. There's something wrong there. 2726, that's not right. Because it's loaded 2626, so it's looking at 2626, and it. Hmm. Have I done some. Oh, John. No, that's right. Hang on. Where's tile set? Oh, it's wrong. That's where I've gone wrong, like a plank. That's meant to be X, X, plus one. Ah, plank. Let's try that again. Right, so we are looking at B, 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 O, B, B, O, B, B, O. Come on, all the way down. Right, so we're going to be in this, that's where our staging area is, B, B, thousand. So we're going to work it out, right, so this boob, yeah, this boob should say... All right, so it's been initialized to zero. Now it should say 2726. Right, is that where our tile data is? Is that where our tile data is? 2726. That's better. Right, let's give it a whirl. Okay. Okay. 
so that's exported it so let's run let's display it so we're going to run it to display nice here we go here we go right let's take that out and tell it to carry on aha nice 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 right let's run this properly not you you right So that's map one, all right? Colors look right. Um, that looks right. Map one, which is up here, this bit. So we're showing this bit here, yeah? So that looks right. Okay, let's try map two. So let's see if we can display this one. shut that down getting confused right map two all right does that look anything like that right so we can't see that because it's blue on blue but that must be there Okay, that's that's map two. Let's try three. And um, before we go on, let's make it black on black. Before we carry on, let's make it black on black. It's because we haven't set it, mate, that's all. That's that's the only reason. I'm just doing it now. So map two should look like that. There we go. So if I move that over there and grab that. There you go, that's better. Right, so we'll do map three. So we're going to do map three, which is this one here. see if that comes up so map three is oh yes that's map three so this is map four so let's try that there you go that's map four So this one's map five. That looks that looks right, doesn't it? So it goes up to there, the screen, up to here. That looks right. Right, let's try map six. So these are the two one, two new ones Fairlane's done for us, right? So let's do map six. Nice. They're right, aren't they? Yep, yeah, they're right. Right, that's map six. And map seven. Oops. Map seven. So that's this bottom one down here. <laughs> nice. Right. 
Right, now the test is, can we get this one to show? So this is in a, com so it's got a completely different character set, yeah? And it's in a different file. So let's try, can we do map eight? No, they're not yet, mate. They're not packed, no. Right, map eight, here we go. Come on. <laughs> Hang on. So that's this bit here. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh. Oh, I see what he's done. I see what he's done. Oh, I see what he's done. I thought I thought there was something wrong with the flames, but he's taken the he's taken the base of the flame off. Um, there, he's taken the base of the flame off. All right, okay. So we don't. Ha so it's just a flame. I do, I do like this. Um, I thought this was a roof, but it's not. It's a cityscape, isn't it? They're houses. I do like that. It'll be interesting to find out where the hunchback start point is. I wonder if it'll be here. Right, okay. So we've now got a... Makes it look glowy, flamey eye like. Yeah. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Right. So, we've got a map loader. So, basically, when you guys create the maps, yeah? So, when you guys create the maps, like this is Stack Bats and the last two maps, the last two levels on here are Fair Lanes with... Other people's... Oh my god, more bits? Thank you very much. You guys really spoil me. Oh, Nicomo, thanks for the bits, mate. It's much appreciated. Thank you very much. So, you guys have got the template. Um, Fairlane's added two more levels to the template, which is fine. It's fine. Because, like I say, as long as, long as the first 16 characters don't get messed around with that's fine because now now we're copying the character set across yeah with the map the data and the stuff so it doesn't matter what you do as long as the first 16 so if you want to have a bash at creating levels the templates in discord yeah the templates in discord i'm gonna i'm gonna say i'm gonna call it there because now we've got the map displayer working so in the next stream, we're going to try and get it scrolling backwards and forwards, yeah? We're, we're going to get all the scrolling aspects working on it, all right? Well, thank you guys for watching. It's it's amazing how it suddenly works straight away <laughs> once we've figured out one thing. All right? Right, I will see you on Wednesday, okay? Well, take care, everybody. Bye. I'd like to thank all the Patreons that are contributing to my channel. Without you guys, I wouldn't be able to do what I'm doing right now. Thank you very much.